My name is Portia Subran and the title of my story is The Devil's Son. I live in Trinidad and Tobago and I'm from the borough of Chagonas. My story focuses on the relationship between two brothers living in 1950s Trinidad. Electricity is now coming to their village of Chagonas and it promises to pull them out of the darkness of the night, but also the darkness of superstition. While I was writing this story, I had one question in mind, and that was, what kind of secret does someone take to the grave? I submitted my story to the prize because all of our stories deserve a platform of preservation. We as Caribbean people have the oral tradition ingrained in us quite strongly. And when I think of the stories passed down to me from my ancestors, it gives me a greater sense of self. Uh, it reminds me that I am not just a static person, but I am an amalgamation of generations. So the prize uh, gives me an opportunity to share these stories to a greater audience. My characters were inspired by the stories my father told me about growing up in colonial Trinidad. His stories about Shigonas are so different from the Shigonas I know today. There was a cinema operated by a generator, bisons drinking from giant copper basins, and also fields of sugarcane and orange and also coconut. The character of Mami is very loosely inspired by my own grandmother who was born a hundred years ago. My mother told me the supernatural rumors that were happening at the time and it really played an integral part of my story. My story is written entirely in Trinidadian dialect. Growing up, writing and speaking in dialect was greatly discouraged in the classroom. But I think the unique flavor, that distinct flavor of our stories and old talk is found in our Trinidadian language and our unique words. So I wanted to create a narrative that embodied this oral tradition that we have. Our stories connect us. 